What's up hey everyone, this is Cybernaut, and today I thought it'd be fun to open up an older Yu-Gi-Oh! 10. I still had one of these like in my cabinet of uh, different sealed products that I have, and that is a Yu-Gi-Oh! Wind-Up Zenmeister 10. Yeah, it's been a while since we opened up one of these, I mean it is one of the older 10s, one of the the last like regular 10s really, you know, it was kind of around that era where then later on we started getting these Mega 10s and stuff, and I don't even remember what year, uh, 20, oh god, it's 10 years ago? Oh man, I'm old! <laughs> I just realized I like, dang, I'm old, aren't I? <laughs> 2011. You know, Zexel is that old. Think about that, you guys. Anyone else feeling it? <sighs> I remember when Zexel was first announced. That didn't seem like it's been that long ago. I guess it has been. But yeah, <laughs> we're gonna open up this tin and see what we can get. Hopefully, I have some good luck. There's a lot of older packs than this. I don't even remember exactly which older packs. Uh, let's see, we have two Storm of Ragnarok, one Extreme Victory, and then two of Hidden Arsenal, four. So, pretty decent stuff. And you also get some promos and stuff, too, like reprints. It was a pretty good tin for back in the day. So, we're at least guaranteed some hollows, too, with Hidden Arsenal. Let's see what we can get. Yeah, it is. Oh, let's not stab ourselves. <laughs> Be careful with that. Seriously, don't do like me. But, uh, also what I was going to say is that even though it is a, uh... Technically like a Zexel tin. There's not Zexel packs in it. It's kind of one of those weird things, right? What is an XC monster? Whew. If I don't know by now, just hit me in the head with a shovel. <laughs> That's what I want right there. That's what we should open up next. Maybe. I'd love for those to get reprinted again. It'd be a lot easier to find. Alright, so let's get to our promos. Looks like they've been... They're a little warped <laughs> from being in there a while. But heavy book always fix that. I expect that with older ones. Older promo packs and stuff. Yeah. <laughs> they're a little twisted. Again, they're not damaged. Heavy book, overnight, just fine. Especially a textbook if you got one. Uh, wind up Zenmeister. Neo Parashath uh, Sky Paladin. Arthur Christia, which was a big reprint for this. Uh, Elmatero Gaia. Big reprint to me because I love Elmateros. And Pot of Duality because I remember when that was $100 each. Now it's been reprinted quite a bit, so not so much. But yeah, <laughs> just look how those are sitting. That makes me sad. Uh, but yeah, they're not damaged. And also, if you guys would like to, please uh, hit that like button and subscribe. It helps out because we don't have a sponsor for today's video, just that. And then also, uh, yeah, we do have our link to a TCG player. If you want to check that out, you click on that link. I'll have it where it takes you to probably one of the packs that is in this tin. But basically, after you click on that link, you buy anything from TCG player. It doesn't have to be Yu-Gi-Oh. doesn't have to be this set, whatever. It can be anything. It helps support the channel. So if you're buying from there anyway, which I do recommend, um, please do that. Hit that link first, because it does help out the channel a lot. Seriously. Anyway, let's get to our packs. Uh, enough uh, wasting time. Storm of Ragnarok, we'll just go in order. Remember, Storm of Ragnarok, you're not guaranteed hollows, but we could get ultimate rares, and there is a ghost rare in this set. So, we'll see. <laughs> Needle Ball, Kata Curries. Scrap Chart, oh, we might actually have something here. Uh, <laughs> let's see, Odin's Eye. Doppel Warrior, that was a pretty good one back in the day, and we got an ultimate rare! Oh man, <laughs> well there you go, I thought I could see on the edges, I was like, do we have something? We do, and and one of the better ones of the set, because this is uh, the set where basically Six Samurais got new support, you know, it, they've gotten more support since then, but still, it was a big game changer for them, so we have Legendary Six Samurai Inishi. That is awesome! He looks really cool as an ultimate rare as well. I miss getting this rarity in just an actual set. That looks so sick. I'll try to remember to have the prices and stuff, too. I don't know if the Ultimate Rare is pricey on this, but every time I get an Ultimate Rare, I keep it, usually. So, <laughs> yeah. I, I just It's like my favorite rarity. So cool looking. But yeah, that was where we got our Legendary Six Samurais. So, that's awesome. Alright, another Storm of Ragnarok. Let's get another one. Come on. <laughs> I want more Ultimate Rares. I miss those days. Almost got a box of this set the other day. Maybe we should. Maybe that was a sign. All right, we got Kagemusha. It's a pretty good one. Nordic Relic, Scrap Shark again. She ends uh, Daredevil, and aw, no Hollow out of that one. Again, you're not guaranteed anything. So yeah, Bloodsucker. <laughs> Extreme Victory. Okay, this is where Tour Guide is. Right here. It's in this pack right here. <laughs> Let's see. I'm going to laugh if I call this. Like, seriously, that'd be awesome. <laughs> I mean, yes, it's totally in here. Uh, let's see. Power Up Adapter. We got a Gladiator Beast. Hey, there you go. Necklord Factory. 
Junk Servant actually uses on Duel Links a lot. And, ah, uh, I was hoping we at least had a Hollow there. But yeah, it's the same as the previous set, like from Ragnarok. You aren't guaranteed anything, but you do have a chance of Ghosts and Ultimate Rare. So, oh well. It, it's worth a shot. Now Hidden Arsenal 4. Everything's holographic in Hidden Arsenal. But let's see if we can get a Dragoonity or a Trishula. Those are like the main things. Let's go for it. Okay. Okay. I am doing it right because I think the, the secret's right up front. So I was trying to add some suspense. And. Oh, the, <laughs> the one I hate to say the name to. Uh, we got Fable uh, Denaria. I think I say it. I always want to say just Fable Diarrhea. <laughs> I'll be honest. Every time I see it, I'm like, well, yeah, that's the name. <laughs> so I, I'm. Yeah. Can you believe I'm 29? Uh, <laughs> I'm starting to remember my age a lot in this video. Neoflameville Shaman. Well, that's a Dragoonity Force, but I'm, you know, mainly after the secret ones. <laughs> Let's see. Nature Ragweed. And uh, even one of our Fables. I, I like that one. <laughs> Little chicken. And now, the last one. Okay. Can we end with something awesome? Share your energy. I should have said Cyber Knight 8610. That probably would have helped me more. Let's see. Hopefully, you guys liking the video will help. Don't remember how I had the pack. Was it? Did we do it like this? I might screw it up. Okay, it's like this. <laughs> Try not to show the card instantly. And I'll take it. You know what? I saw Syncrest. I was really hoping. That's a good one, though. I'll take it. The Fabled uh, Kadabi. I think that's how you say it, actually. <laughs> yeah, I remember these lower synchro, like lower level synchros that they had in Fabled. They were actually pretty cool. I think they were decent, like in Duel Links at some point. So that's not bad. And then Fabled Chihuahua, <laughs> Drag Dino. Playing the Origin, and even another Dragoonity Force. Unfortunately, not a Dragoonity that's really used. But yeah, I can't complain. I got Ultimate Rare, so I'm happy. Especially for a tin that's just been kind of just sitting back in my cabinet. So I hope you guys have enjoyed. Let me know if you guys want to see some more older, like, tin openings or special editions or something. Because I've been kind of in the mood lately to find some older tins. Like, especially if I can find the really old ones, but those have, like, because everything's high for card games right now. I'm still on the lookout. But especially if you're talking, like, 5Bs, Zexel, even like GX era, those are still actually kind of decent on the prices. So let me know if you want to see more of those. And of course, too, with uh, special editions, because we don't have special editions anymore. Again, I, I miss those. So I thought about getting some of those too. So if you would like to see any of that, have like any requests or whatever, you know, any kind of opening you want to see, even if it's hard to find a pack, let me know. I'll try. <laughs> I'll at least the very least try, you know, on that. And I do read all the comments. So let me know on that. And uh, yeah. As always, thank you guys for watching. Stay safe out there, you guys. And of course, I will catch you guys later. See ya.